Hello, my name is Charles Bradley. All of the songs that I say I'm more I've done got a piece of my life. If in it somewhere, it's a piece of my life. And the deepest one was heartaches and pain and why it's so hard. That's when our first album. Those was really, and why I'm saying why it's so hard, I'm talking about me. Asking of all the changes and trials and tribulations that I've been through in life and trying to begging for an opportunity. The Hippo Joint is in San Francisco on Broadway. I was working there the day I was a chef. And I said, wow, Jane Brown, I'm up here and here. I said, I'm going to go and see what's going on. So I went backstage and he said, oh, no, 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 no. He didn't want me there. So like they told Jane Brown, five minutes, curtain's time. So Jane Brown came to the backstage this week on the curtain to call him out. I was about, I was in 1980, 89 or something. I said, Jane, give me a chance, man. I've been fighting for a chance a long time. He looked at me, he said, young man, I ain't gonna let you get on no show and take my show from me now. He said, what you have to do, go back to New York. That's where the opportunity is That's where I found my chance at. So that's where you should go at. Some people at my age, 63 years old, never find that chance. And I know that when I'm on stage, when I'm performing, and I look at people's faces. I met a man one time, he was about 60 something years old. And he said, Charles, you made me realize that my life is not over. You know, now you thank me for that. So if I can help anybody with my music, I'm gonna give you pauses. I'm not gonna give you nothing negative. The craziest show I done was in California and uh, the house was packed. And they was having a good time. I was really into it. I was in a feeling, then I went They've been off the stage to shake hands with everybody. And before I know it, they had me surfing. <laughs> and that really, I ain't never felt like that in my life. It really messed with my head. I was saying, put me down. And they would just pass me like a piece of tissue. And that was a memory that, when they put me back on stage, I was like a statue, like, I couldn't believe it. The Apollo is to me is like, wow, coming home. Because if you get the Apollo like you, because Apollo got some very bitter and crazy ways. If you get the Apollo like you, then you know you're good. Oh.